first ride with the rider, also first ride with the, with the wife on the bike. You know how long I've been waiting for that? Fucking five months. So this is how lucky I am. The fucking LTO, the system is down so I cannot get my license swapped today. So th <laughs> this is where you pass your license in the Philippines for the car test. Okay? And for the motorcycle too. Practical examination area. What the fuck actually? Anyway, you better watch for the hole here if you come with the bike. So yeah, fun. It's more fun in the Philippines. I'm still gonna get that fucking motorcycle today. I'm gonna go and buy it. Let me go piece of the kids. Hello. Hello. You mo Hello. Hello. Yeah. See you later. I need petrol. I need petrol. This one? Yeah. Full tank. Full tank, yeah. Well, wow, maximum 600. What? Maximum 600 pesos. I'm not sure what the full tank is. Uh, 150? 150 pesos for the full tank. Fucking hell. Oh shit. Didn't realize. Fucking uh. Fuck me. Didn't realize the light wasn't on. Nice car. I want this. Fucking hell. I don't know. Anyway, I wanted to go there. <laughs> kind of lost. Should I do that? Good looking. See mine, new, you see his. Nobody wanna smell that fucking bus. Oh, the cowboy! Oh, I want that bike, man. Ah, fuck, fuck, sick. I'm on low. Okay, I'm on low and uh, sitting low, yeah? And now I'm telling me this is the top, you cannot go faster. You cannot put another gear, a six gear on it. It's on the top. Fuck. Now I know. Never be on low if you want to go fast. I think low is really good for traffic and, you know, when you're filtering. But not to go fast. For 70 miles, 70 kilometers, that's it. Me, I'm bored. I feel good to have finally a bike. I can have some content and share. So the way I do it the last five months with no bike, I uh, I used to have, I like that kind of bike. I would like to get one like this one there. Yeah? The old bike and uh, with a bit like something like that. 
cafe where it's all, all scrambled, I'm not sure yet. Anyway, um, so the way I do it, I knew that I'm gonna be leaving to the Philippines, so I knew that at some point in 2016 I would have no bike. So I started to save some video on the side and I had like 15 of them. I think it was 15. 15 daily observations made in 2015. And uh, the problem with this is most, a lot of them basically were shit. It's just not worth sharing. So I cut it, I cut them all and share and mix them with uh, Iceland video and I mix them with some YBR video from the insurance when they give me the bike. And that's how I managed to share. So if you a motovlogger, you want a tips, you want an advice, just make sure you have some content on the side if something happened to you. Now I'm officially lost, I don't know where I'm going. Nice. I'm not lost, I'm not lost, I know where I'm going now. Jolly B is here. If I find Jolly B, I know where the fuck I'm going. Tell you to counterflow? You counterflow. They're actually telling you to do it. How cool is that? Only in the Philippines. 